Hello, welcome back. Today we are going to talk about the gradient descent optimizers. You may have seen this kind of uh, videos where we can see uh, a bunch of different kind of optimizers. In this video we are going to focus uh, on the easiest one, the stochastic, stochastic gradient descent. So we will see now how it works. First of all we are going to talk about the stochastic gradient descent that is d d first of all we initialize uh, we define g as the derivative of our uh, of the error with respect our parameter and uh, this Greek letter represents the a weight or a bias so you can do both and when we are updating it we, we do that our parameter the weight or the bias is equal to our parameter minus our learning rate multiplied by the by g and when we are coding it uh, we are going to put a parameter minus equal learning rate g what is the learning rate this Greek letter mu is uh, represents the speed of, of learning of our algorithm so if you want to to, uh, to reach a minimum really quickly uh, you may initialize this variable uh, with a high value if you don't mind about the speed you set the, va the value to 0 0.00 sorry 0 0.001 uh, this is the uh, the normal value that we are going to set to this variable and there is also an, uh, uh, another variant that is the decay that serves this learning rate and also create a lambda that represents the learning uh, the decay multiplied by the weight but now, um, but we are going to initialize uh, lambda, another hyperparameter, to zero. So we we are not going to use that in our coding. So that's all. This is the stochastic gradient descent. Now we are going to implement this optimizer. The first thing that we are going to do is uh, in uh, create the optimizer class. optimizer protected we are going to define again matrix scala dynamic and one Okay. We create uh, now the, the the virtual destructor virtual optimizer that is override. Okay. And virtual reset function 
Okay, I forgot void because we are not going to return any value and the virtual void update this is the, ma the main part first of all we are going to give us parameter the derivative of the, uh, the derivative of the error with respect our parameter and then the parameter parameter okay so now the first thing that we need to do is create a new item inside optimizer 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 and with the name of stochastic gradient descent Okay, so now we can we can start coding it. Um, we include again core. Oh, sorry. And the optimizer. The stochastic gradient class will heritage from optimizer and now we are going to define our public values scalar m le rate the learning rate scalar m the decay I forgot to include the configuration we create the constructor of the learning rate scalar 0 0.001 Okay, and we are going to define the decay as I said as I said before to zero. Scalar zero. And the update function date. Now, uh, we can uh, we can see our formula that I said before, I wrote before, is our vector, our uh, the vector in which we are uh, that represents the weight or the bias minus equal the learning rate. Okay. <laughs> um, multiplied by the vector plus m decay multiplied by the vec. This is that's all. We have just coded the stochastic gradient system. We can now start the defining our neural net and everything because we we have we've almost finished now what we are going to do is include it include the optimizer and include the optimizer sgd.h Thank you for watching it and see you in the next video where we will talk about 
de momentum. Gradient descent. <laughs>